Item grab bag, one on a roll and keepers, one guys. Let's reroll on a roll. Risky moves, it's not needed. Keepers, also not needed. Switching gears is really good. Switching strikes is also good, but I'm building rep off anyway. Oh, he's switching gears, switching gears. Switching gears. We have good items. Okay, so I found something out, okay? Oh, these guys are all pretty strong, huh? These, are, these guys are all... Oh, this guy is pretty weak. Okay, I mean, I'm just gonna play this. I'm not gonna buy this. I'm just gonna pre-level. I can get a better headliner next turn. And then I can start winning. Okay, we just chill, we just chill. So I found something out. Apparently, um, with switching gears, it got buffed, right? It's pretty good now. Also, we're on Skull of Huddle. That's why I'm so rich, guys. Uh, switching gears, gain three gold whenever you break your win or loss streak. This thing is grayed out at the start of the game, which doesn't mean a streak at all. But apparently it's like a win streak. You only get the three gold if you lose the first fight. I'm gonna get three gold now because I lost the first fight because the grayed out thing counts as a win, basically. You should probably write that somewhere, but again, yeah. It's like the little detail you gotta know about this augment. I'll get three gold here. Deserved. I got a bruiser. Now I wanna win, right? Now I wanna win. I got a bruiser headliner. That's pretty freaking good. I can go Crown Guard on him. And Infinity Edge on him because he's freaking busted. I need a bruiser. I probably play Bard instead. It heals me. That is pretty good. I hope I can win. I hope I can win now. Get switching gears value. He's level 3 still. We're freaking chilling. He's level 3. He has 4 Katarinas. 4? He has four Kidarinas! Brother man! Four! How is that even possible? It's stage two too, man. I'm happy if I have four Kidarinas at stage three. If I'm playing Kidarina reroll. Oh, I think I'll lose this. Actually, Loki is gonna heal enough. I think she has heal reduction. So unlucky, man. I get stunned at the perfect time. Ah, oh, that was so disgusting, man. I, I don't even want to watch that anymore. Jesus Christ, man. Uh, bro, can I win this? I have pentakill now. I need another bruiser. Nah, that was so disgusting. That was so freaking disgusting. I mean, I could play sentinel. I, I get stronger that way. I want to make 30, you know? I want to make 30. I could just level. That, that was really freaking vile to look at. Holy man. Okay, I mean, still enough people are weak. Enough people are weak. This guy's pretty strong. But it should be fine. His front line is such a joke. Alright, I'm just gonna sell this. I'm just gonna play like this. Because I want Pentakill anyway. I, I, I win this fight, I get 30. That's pretty good. I get 30 here. And then I get 3 gold from switching gears. And this augment is really good now. After they buffed it from 2 to 3 gold. It makes a huge difference. Because now I executed it well two times, right? That's like before the patch three times. So, like perfectly so far. Which you'll never... you almost never be perfect, right? With it. I'm third pick. Which is definitely a problem. I don't think I'm getting my item. Yeah, the bow is gone. Frick. I mean, I could go Titans. Nah, I'll just go this, man. Like, it, it's so bad to go Titans. Because I have Ezreal items so far, and I, I think I need to continue with Ezreal items. And, like, Titans makes me really strong. I would win the fight. But do I want to win the fight? That's the question, right? I don't even want to win this fight. Now, I definitely want... I got my three gold, so I can buy this. I, I want to keep Heart Steel, of course. We're playing most, most likely Ezreal here, as always. I could level, but I want to lose, right? So I'll level next turn. Okay. Not too bad. I think we'll lose this. He's, he has a very strong front line and has two two-star backliners. Not the best, like not the most impressive items, but like good enough, right, to beat me. Good enough to beat me for sure. Unfortunately, we will... Oh, I hope he focuses the set. 
I hope my Olaf focus is set next. Ah. Maybe Kale can kill the set. No, I don't think so. I don't think so. Unless she can burst him. If she can ult him before he ults. No, he ulted. Sad, bro. But it's fine, it's fine. Still lose, that's good. I'm gonna get three gold here. Do I even level? I feel like making 50 is so nice, bro. I mean, winning is also nice, right? I always win against this guy. I can win against this guy. And I feel like I always lose against this guy. I split my team a little bit. This is not that bad. It's really not that bad. I think we can win this, low-key. The Yasuo is pretty impressive, but so is my Olaf. And the Yasuo is stuck on the guy, but now he's focusing my Olaf, so... Nah, actually, Titan, Sterox, freaking Bloodthirster, ain't no way we're winning this. It's impossible to win, actually, yeah. The Yasuo is just 1v9. Ah, sad. Oh, well. We only lose one gold from, the, from leveling. It's not that big of a deal. We'll get a new headliner, right? Spellweaver. Spellweaver. Who gets Infinity Edge then? I don't have a damage dealer. And this guy's freaking trash. Nah, I think I'll keep the Olaf. Which is not good because I need to win. I need to win the fight. This guy would be really nice with Crown. But I don't have... Maybe I'll drop some good units here from the from the Skull Crabs. And we're not on Crab Rave. We are on Skull Puddle. So there won't be a scary crab. We will just get the regular Skull Puddle here. I win the game for free. Is that how it is? Ooh, I win the game for free, huh? So I get rep buff. I get bloodthirster. It's not even bad. Pretty sure I'm leveling here. I want to play hard steel. I want to play hard steel. I'm not going to pop this yet. I'm going to pop this very late. Actually, it would be nice to win. Nah, I'm going to pop it when I manip manipulate it. We want to have 10 traits. 10 traits listed. And then three of those traits will be in the book. After that. Well, that's, this guy is like giga strong. A giga, giga strong, man. Giga strong. Stupendously strong. Look at this. Double death blade. Impossible to beat, right? Has rep up as well, so heal reduction. We just kill this Lilia and we're happy, no? Kill Lilia and we're happy. You freaking idiots, man. Ah, uh, Kale was so close to ulting, it's fine. <clears throat> Alright, so I need... What do I need here? Nothing. 67 health. I have a heart steal. Couple silver augments, man. Silver ticket. Definitely not. It's just silver whale, right? 5% attack speed. And this is at the start of combat, which is really good. Recombobulator, what does that do? Nothing. One four cost, two four costs, nothing. Huh. Silver Veil, we get a bruiser. We don't have the Tom Kench, of course. Uh, I don't think I'm leveling right. I'm not leveling. I'm just gonna keep playing this. I'm just gonna sack this entire stage. Hard steal, cash out. Don't raise the stakes, just cash out. Cash out hard steel and call it day. Cash out hard steel, call it day. Yes, you need to have a combat with 10 traits, yeah. Or 8. 8 is also good, you get 2 of them. But I want to go 10 because I'm already level 6, I can easily get 10. I'm just gonna have it at Wolves. Wolves, I will manipulate it as much as I can with the best traits I can. Like what are good what are good thingies? Heart steel will be fine. Edge Lord will be trash. Crowd Diver is okay. Rapid Fire is okay. Sentinel is fine. Sentinel is fine. 8-bit is probably fine as well. 
obviously jazz, right? Obviously, as always. Uh, this thing is trash, right? It's just Boozer Spellweaver and stuff. We do not want Spellweaver that actually sabotages us. True damage is great. True damage will be great, yeah. But honestly, with the items I have, it's just jazz, bro. Hopefully we get jazz. If we don't get jazz, we're screwed. We need to just buy any of the jazz units until then. I can't really roll, right? I can't really roll. That's the problem. These hidden mechanics are annoying. They are, yeah. It is what it is. They are. We should not have to read tweets to know how these things function. But it is what it is. I think he's not gonna die. Oh, he's gonna die. Oh, nice, nice. I win this. This is good. Oh, no, I don't win this. I mean, honestly, that's fine as well. It's a one unit loss. That's really good. Holy frick, Ezreal with tear. Don't mind if I do, man. That's perfect. <laughs> Alright, that's freaking perfect. That's huge. Big Shot is also an okay trade to get. Okay, so we need to drop a tier here, or drop a tier from our ha cash out to get blue buff. And then we're good to go. But we're not really good to go, right? I'm so low HP, man. Oh, nice. I am kind of good to go, though. Crowd Diver Headliner. I mean, that's for sure stronger than this. But then I don't need to play this. I don't have a set, right? I don't have a set. I don't have a freaking set, man. I don't have a freaking set. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Need to get one more in somehow. We need to get one more in. One more. It's kind of hard, right? Oh, I can get this instead of uh, Uni. This instead of Uni. Gives me 8-bit. Gives me 8-bit additionally to all the stuff that I already have. Okay, so we just play this for one turn. Cash out here. I can just do it next turn, right? I don't want Country Emblem. How, how bad is Country Emblem? It's pretty freaking bad, no? Still nine, still nine. Still nine. <laughs> and remember, they don't need to be active. Just list it here. Doesn't matter if they're active. Just nine traits list, uh, ten traits listed. And then we open this. We have three of them. Three of those traits at random in the book. Forty-three health is pretty low, man. Uh, I don't really want eight bit, right? I would rather have country. Mosher is not okay either. I lose Edgelord. I lose Edgelord. I mean, I already have country possibility, right? Because of her. So what the, what the frick am I doing? I just do this. Yeah, now it's uh, 10. 3, 3, 3, and then 10. Okay. Alright, so now we just open it. Oh, there's Jazz. There's Jazz. I, I have to play Jazz. I have to play Jazz. Oh, nice. I still have the same. Okay. Okay, now I don't have 8-bit, right? I have Jazz. Nice, 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 nice. Okay. We can get Jazz. If we get Jazz, it's huge. You can just play it during neutrals. So that way you don't have to giga grief your team. If this is another book, I'll, I'll laugh. Oh my god. I mean, Pentakill Emblem, I'll take it. Oh. Okay, but, okay, I'm telling you. So you might think, okay, just take Pentakill Emblem. I will not make it to level 10. I promise you, or to level 9. I will not make it to level 9. I've been in this mistake. I've done this mistake so many times. It is 100% jazz. 100% jazz. 
100% jazz, guys. It's not even close. Like, it's 100% jazz, bro. It's not even close. It's not even remotely close, by the way. 100% jazz. I'm not making it to level 10, man. Trust me on that. Eh, to level 9. I've, I've done that so many times. Like, look, I'm, I'm literally dying right now. As we speak, I'm dying. As we speak, I'm freaking dying. I have to roll on 8 first to stabilize. And then I have to reach level 9. Against all the freaking Ezreal players, right? If I play Pentakill now. Which is just so stupid, right? There's no way we're doing that. I think it's this. Am I gonna get some 4 cost headliners? Oh my god, that's huge. I have Giga Traits. I have Giga Traits. I have Giga freaking Traits. I have Heal Reduction already. I need Edge of Night. I go Heart Seal Emblem, but I... Like, I'm 29 health, bro. I'm not going Heart Seal Emblem, guys. I have 29 health, I'm not going hard steel emblem. I promise you that, guys. I don't have a Zac. I need a freaking Zac so badly. And then who do I play instead of Zac? I need Tactician's Crown here. Tactician's Crown here, I win the game. I promise you. Tactician's Crown here, like a spatula, I win the game. Like, the thing is, I don't want to two-star her, man. I, I can't, bro. I don't have money. I, I need... To save money for Zack. I mean, this this thing is two star. Like, it two star is two star. No, I play this instead of this. It's not even good though. I lose Jazz and EDM. I just need Zack. I just need Zack. I just need Zack. Not this one. Sure, I'll I'll two star you. You piece of garbage, stupid idiot, man. Also, he always gets Edge of Night. I have insane jazz value already, which is pretty nice. Like, I either go Tactician's Crown or Blue Buff here, right? Tactician's Crown or Blue Buff. And I'm back. Tactician's Crown or Blue Buff. Tactician's Crown or Blue Buff. Ideally, Tactician's Crown. Oh my god. I think he's gonna take it, no? This little rat. This little rat kid, man. Ah, frick, man. Like, I have less health than you, you piece of trash. Why are you getting it? You don't even have a freaking spatula. Hopefully, he just get, lo loses now. He's playing country, so he wants to spat, but he doesn't even have a cloak. Hopefully, he doesn't get a cloak here, and he just loses. Deserved. Ah, it's so sad, man. Like, I hate losing the 50-50. I have less health, but we pick at the same time because the carousel is just awfully designed, right? There's nothing you can do. But I'm getting my cash out, which isn't that bad. I'll just buy this for sure. I'll just keep rolling, right? Like, a Zac gives me so much power, you know? A Zac gives me so much power. Like, what? Okay. Okay! That's great! Also, I should frontline this trash, man. There's nothing. Punk emblem. I want to go hard steel, but I want to go for it on Zed. On Zach. Um, I don't really want guard breaker on Zed, right? I mean, it's fine though. I have to go guard breaker on Zed, right? I mean, I'm winning this fight anyway, so let's just wait. I'm winning this fight anyway. Nice. The puppy is really tanky. I have a remover, so if I get a warmogs, ah, I want warmogs, man. 
Or I go I go steadfast on Poppy. I go steadfast on Poppy. I can just go hard steel emblem. I can ditch. Do I wanna ditch set though? I only wanna ditch set if I get a better bruiser, no? If I if I get if I get uh, the girl. Okay, now I have to level, right? I have to level here. And honestly, now I think it's worth to just go for the steadfast on this poppy man. And now I can, we can actually move this on him and it's not even that bad. And now we need uh, to level and play Ziggs and we call it a day. Play Ziggs, call it a day. Well, we want to play Lucian as well, right? Lucian. And if we got a Tactician's Crown, bro. Okay, we need Edge of Night on Zed. We need Edge of Night on Zed. Is Yone good here? Brother, Hard Steel, Crowd Diver. Pay attention, brother. Please. Of course he's good. Like, what, what else do I do, man? No offense. People say there is no dumb questions. There isn't. After you paid attention properly. But if you're just straight up not even trying to pay attention, just blurting something, that is... That is definitely a dumb question. No offense. No offense, guys. No offense. And this is great. Emo Poppy is so good as well. Like, we got so lucky. Emo Poppy just gives a free trade. Okay, I'm getting a bunch of money. I could go blue buff Zed. It's not even bad. Edge of Night blue buff. Edge of Night blue buff. Sure. Uh, Edge of Night blue buff, right? Yeah. It's not even bad. Okay. And now we just need to reach level 9, right? We just need to reach level 9. We have a hard steel emblem. We can just ditch... Um, we can ditch this guy for Ilawi and play hard steel anyway. We could also just ditch this guy. We ditch this guy for Kiana, by the way. Yeah. We ditch this, this guy for Kiana. Ditch that guy for Kiana. This guy, did he hit his freaking emblem? Did he hit his emblem or no? No, he doesn't have three star Hecarim. So I don't think he did. He didn't hit Cloak, right? Hello, 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 hello. No, Twi Ezreal. Ezreal, bro, just use your Mystic Shot, man. Okay. Holy freak, Ezreal. Just use your freaking Mystic Shot, man. Little guy. I'm selling these. Freaking. Just committed to going level 9. I need another Heart Steel cash out and then I'll be, I'll be pretty strong, right? Like, I'm still scaling. There's a hard steel guy, but it doesn't do anything. I just need to play Ziggs, right? Level 9 Ziggs, call it a day. Play Kiana over this, go hard steel emblem. That's about it, that's all I can do, no? Like, that's it, that's literally it, man. I'll just go hard steel on somebody. I'll just go hard steel emblem on... I mean, I can just do it on him, no? I just do it on her, freak it. A little bit of bonus health, because she's actually a big shot, she does a little bit of damage. This guy is so freaking strong as well, but he doesn't have Ezreal. Wait, 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 I'm way stronger. Wait, he's so weak. Wait, look at his... I saw the Poppy, right? The Poppy is so scary, but like... Because his Poppy has Warmogs, which is better than mine. I, I don't have Warmogs, so it's much weaker. Yeah, I, just, I just go Kiana, we're good to go. We just level next turn. After Carousel, we level. We'll have a, like we'll have like 25 gold to roll, and then we can we can uh, we can chill. Yeah, not too bad. And we just ditch Yone. Yone is worthless. Kiana is insane. We're not gonna have true damage though. Nice. Some money is not even bad. It is the end. Some money isn't even bad. We play Ziggs. We level next turn. We don't need to level right now. We have insane items on our carries, insane items on Poppy. I mean, it's looking good. It's looking great. I'm just gonna use this again because sometimes it bugs. Not really, but like, in the past, these kind of things would bug. I'm gonna put him in the middle against the Akali player. Okay, so this guy is playing the same team as me, just he has Caitlyn, but he's level 9 and he has Lucky Gloves. A bunch of Lucky Gloves. 
Yeah, Lucky Gloves with Hard Steel is insane because you, you can get so many Lucky Gloves from Hard Steel, right? Uh, we lose hard, we lose hard, bro. We lose hard. He has so much value on his team. Uh, but I feel like he's the strongest guy in the lobby, right? And I'm gonna get so much uh, Jazz value now. Jazz, or Jazz Emblem. I mean, there's a Lucian with a Ginsu's. I just have to take that, right? I just have to take that. I'll just plop down Lucian. I won't even play Ziggs then. I just plop down Lucian here. I'm not gonna sell this girl, of course. And we just play Lucian with, with Ginsu's. It's his best item. Or one of his best. Maybe Hurricane is better, but like, you want both, right? Alright, so I'm not even playing Ziggs. Alright, there's a Kiana. I'll just two-star this because I'm close to maxing out my team. Okay. I mean, I, I have Zack 1, man. I still need to keep rolling, right? I have Zack 1. So stupid. Also, why, why did I put this on her? Oh no, she's not. we don't even have true damage. We don't even have true damage. 32%. 30% on freaking Jazz. Actually insane. 30% health. 16% damage. Crazy, bro. I know there's rapid fire and true damage, which obviously I would like to play, but how do I play it, right? Like, who do I ditch for it, man? Like, who, who the frick do I ditch? I don't ditch this. 25, 15. 32, 16. It might be worth. Okay, it's definitely worth if it's two star Ki uh, Kiana and two star Lucian. And I get a Kiana item. Then it's definitely worth, right? Then it's definitely worth. Because, like, I lose only 1% damage. I lose, like, 7% of health, which is kind of annoying, but still. I think uh, getting Rapid Fire on Lucian, getting True Damage on Kiana is insane if they are actually upgraded. But if they're both 1 star, and one of them doesn't even have an item, then it's just useless, right? Alright, nice. Okay, I'm top 4, I'm top 4. Can we get more than that, though? That's the question. The thing is, it does make the rest of the team much weaker, right? And remember, this is Skull... This is not Crab Rave, so I'm not gonna die here. Otherwise, I would I would for sure die. I would for sure die against freaking Skull... Like, Crab Rave, man. Yeah, we need Even Shroud, right? We don't have Armor Pen. That's a big deal. We Actually, we need Last Whisper. Because Even Shroud is too flimsy if it's not on this thing. It's gonna die on Zack. I have a remover again. Edge of Night, it's probably just Guard Breaker on Lucian. No Armor Pen. Probably just Death Blade on Lucian then. Okay, I'm getting Lucian too, maybe. Okay, I'm not making 2 star this girl, that's for sure. I got Lucian too. I got three item Lucian too. Three item Lucian too. This has to be worth, right? Three item Lucian too. Rapid fire. This has to be worth. I lose like a little bit of health, but I gain so much damage on the Lucian. Honestly, though, I don't even gain that much. No, I do though. I do. Like rapid fire is significant for sure. It's a three item Lucian too. I did not expect to get Lucian too, man. That's actually so lucky, you know. I should have bought uh, set 2. Set 2 adds a lot of frontline. Now we have this guy as well, right? Do we just... Wait. Wait, we'll have 4 Bruiser. We'll lose 2 trades though. We'll lose 2 Jazz trades. But like, this unit is so much better. We'll lose 2 Jazz trades. But frick it, right? This unit is so much better. This unit is freaking busted, bro. Like, what? Like, look how busted it is, man. And then I have Thieves Glove on her. It's not even bad. 
I lost a little bit of jazz value. I lost like 6% health and like 3% or 4% damage. But I gained freaking tentacles that are so much frontline. And I gained like the most well-equipped freaking Ilawi as well. It's not just Ilawi, it's like so well-equipped, right? And I gave 4 Bruiser. So it's like even tankier and this guy's tanky. It's definitely worth, right? So what am I rolling for then? Just uh, Kiana 2, I guess, right? Kiana 2. And Zack 2. And Z2. Uh, set 2. Set 2. Set 2. Kiana 2, Set 2. I need to position well here. This guy's really strong. I'm just gonna bully his freaking Thresh here, which is good, hopefully. Nice, we're bullying Thresh, so he's not gonna ult as much. We're gonna stun him. Nice, good stun. Huge. He's almost dead already. Nice, he's freaking dead. My Lucian is so well equipped compared to his. Like, Deathblade Ginsu's, man. Crazy freaking Lucian. Crazy freaking Lucian, man. Can we get a top 2? Can we get a top 1, maybe? Another Spatula does nothing. Too late, unfortunately. I don't have 8-bit. To get 8-bit instead of true damage, but that doesn't even do anything. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's just Bramble Vest on freaking Zack, right? Just Bramble Vest on Zack for sure. Oh, nice. That's big. Oh, frick, she low-rolled items, though. And I'm frontlining this because it's so bad, it does nothing. Might as well not have it, man. Alright, this guy is actually really strong, man. And he has freaking Akali. With not the best items, though, so I don't think I care. The, 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 the Karthus, I care about Karthus, though. Do we lose this? I don't know. Hopefully not. Oh, nice, Akali is getting bullied. By Kiana. My Zed is cooking. Akali is dead. Lucian is full HP. He's not getting ulted. Lucian ults one more time here and wipes. Nice. Good job. We wipe him. He's almost dead. I have 6 HP. I didn't fight Ghost, so I should fight Ghost now, right? I'm guaranteed to fight Ghost, right? I'm looking for one set. To duplicate. Looking for one set to duplicate. I have to fight Ghost, right? I didn't fight Ghost. I didn't fight Ghost. I have to fight Ghost, right? He has so much jazz value. But he doesn't even have much more than me. Okay, hopefully we bully that. Yeah, we're fighting Ghost. This should be an easy win, so I'm top two. Can we get top one? I need to see what the survivor um, has to upgrade and deny it, because my only... Remaining upgrade is set. I'm never gonna make it to level 10. So just pay attention to what he wants. The winner. Okay, so this guy wants... Set 2 and... Um, and Yorick 2, right? Is he even playing Yorick? He is. Yeah, he wants Yorick 2. Cashing out here. Don't I just roll before him then? He already has Lucian 2. I'm just rolling to deny Yorick... Like, I'm just rolling before him, it doesn't even matter, because I don't have to hit anything. He needs to low roll the Thieves' Glove on the Ziggs, right? And then I win. He hit Bar 2, which doesn't matter. Okay, I didn't hit Yorick. Okay, now the problem is we have no items left, right? We have no items left now. I guess I just itemize him. I don't think I itemize her. This doesn't do anything. Oh, also, um, I'm stupid as frick, aren't I? I honestly, it's not even that bad. I should have scouted. I'm so dumb, man. I should have removed the freaking jazz emblem off of this guy and put it on this guy. And get, given the Zack the, the adaptive helm. So dumb, man. I should have done that for sure. Are we winning? I think we're winning. 
Let's go, baby. The freaking Yalawi headliner clutched it, I think. So strong. GG, guys. If we took the pentakill emblem, I would have died at level 8. I pinky promise. Don't try to get 10 pentakill unless you're very, very healthy. And we can win without it with Jazz Emblem because Jazz Emblem is beyond broken at level 8 and at level 9. Subscribe and the bell if you enjoy these TFT videos. Also, make sure to leave an algorithmic comment and an algorithmic like down below to support this video in the algorithm so I can get some more views. And I'll see you next time.